Some scary moments in Martin County this morning as the front of a 100 year old building collapsed. It happened around 730 at the old Mitchell's Photography Building that's on Main Street in Williamston. This comes just eight weeks after a Coca Cola bottling plant collapsed in Everett's. WNCT's Jessica Jewell spoke to business owners near the collapsed building. This 127 year old building in downtown Williamston was reduced to rubble this morning. That has local residents and business owners concerned about other buildings nearby. This is what the old Mitchell's photography building looked like in January when we first told you crews were concerned about its condition. This is what it looked like today. This place is old. I mean, you know, people come here and there's a lot of closed businesses for a long time. Don't worry about the other buildings too. You know, because people walk up here all the time, and I do a lot of walking. But I'm just so glad that I was walking on that side during that time. In the shadow of the old brick city building, now lies this pile of bricks. A majority of these buildings on Main Street were built in the late 1800s. So, yes, there are some buildings that are in sections of disrepair that need some attention. Jason Lewis owns three businesses nearby. As you can see, nothing has really come anywhere close to this building, so I'm not too terribly worried about it. We're going to still put time and effort and money into the downtown area. He says it's up to other business owners to keep these buildings from crumbling. You go in, you do the work, you keep them updated, uh, you keep them so that they're not going to end up like that. If you do that, you don't have anything to worry about. Others aren't so convinced. I hate it. You don't want Wimson to go down. We we're trying to build it up so we have some place to shop and get jobs. Town leaders are meeting tomorrow to discuss what to do with the building moving forward. In Williamston, Jessica Jewell, 9 on your side. Williamston recently received accreditation from the National Main Street Program. It awards towns who follow standards for historic preservation and revitalization.